Hi everyone, I'm Drian Alexandres Mercado Santos. I am Jun Carla Z.M. Magkalas. And I am Gian Carmel Viray. And we are here to present you some of the periodic table elements and their product. But first, what is the periodic table and its elements? Periodic table, also known as the periodic table of elements, is a tabular display of the chemical elements. It is widely used in chemistry, physics, and other sciences, and is generally seen as an icon of chemistry. The periodic table has gone through many changes since Dmitry Mendeleev drew up its original design in 1869. Yet both the first table and the modern periodic table are important for the same reason. The periodic table organizes elements according to similar properties so you can tell the characteristics of an element just by looking at its location on the table. Why is it so important, you ask? The table is useful for modern students and scientists because, because it helps predict the type of chemical reaction that a particular element is likely to participate in. The table tells each element are atomic numbers and usual its atomic weight. The typical charge of an element is indicated by its group. Now that you have a knowledge about the periodic table, let's proceed to its elements and its products. Our first element is most common one, copper. Copper or cube is a thin pure form. is a reddish brown metallic element with high ductility and malleability that is an excellent conductor of heat and electricity. Atomic weight 63.54, atomic number 29. Copper can be used to make a variety of products, but we choose an electric wire or a cell phone charger. Copper electrical wires are safer to use than wires made of most other conductive metals because they are resistant to heat. It has high electrical conductive, is inexpensive, it's ductile and it's thermal resistant. This mix is the universally accepted standard for the manufacturing of electrical wires. Next is the fluorine. Fluorine is the most reactive and most elegunative of all elements. Fluorine is a pale yellow diamantic highly corrosive flammable gas with potent odor. It is slightly homogen atomic weight 18.998403 U atomic number. In fluorine, our product is toothpaste. Fluorine is effective in preventing caries by suppressing the activity of pulp plaque and strengthen the teeth. Fluoride toothpaste exert effect that prevent carriers such as suppressing acid production, promoting remineralization and strengthening the teeth substrate. And for our final element and product, it is argon. Argon has approximately the same solubility in water as oxygen and 2.5 times more soluble in water than nitrogen. Argon is colorless, odorless, non-flammable, and non-toxic as a solid, liquid, or gas. Argon is chemically inert under most conditions and forms no confirmed stable compounds as room temperature. Its atomic weight is 39.948 you the atomic number is 18. argon is used in light bomb argon gas is used to fluorescent and indecent light bombs to stop the oxygen in the light bombs for the corroding hot tungsten filament the use of argon in light bombs prevent the evaporation of the tungsten filament which resort to the Light life. That's all for now folks, we hope you've learned something new about science and that you'll buy some of our products. 
Again, this is Dreyan, June Carl, and Gian with Miguel Sanchez, a scriptwriter, and Kirsten Lumalu as editor. Thank you for watching.